And welcome back folks, welcome back to Let's Play Call of Duty World War 2, I'm Verm. And we're going back into another Zombies map now, this time we're doing the Shadow Throne, which is the third main map of the game. Of course we did Gruston House as well, which was like more of a typical survival map from like really early Call of Duty days. But now we're going again with uh, the intention of doing very little except enjoying the map. So let's get going. I believe this map's considered one of the worst in all of Zombies. We'll see how it plays. I did uh, just set Black Ops Cold War downloading on the PS5. I'm curious to see how that stacks up with ray tracing and stuff like that on there. Um, because I'm running a 1080 Ti, I can't really enable ray tracing on Cold War. You always want that 60 FPS for Call of Duty. And yeah, ray tracing dips it well below that, even at 1080p. So, be nice to see. I don't expect ray trace shadows to make a huge difference in a Call of Duty game, but. I don't really mind. Be nice to test out the haptic feedback and adaptive triggers too. If I can find a way of recording that and Modern Warfare on PS5, I probably will do to be honest. So as I said, this is the Shadow Throne, I think widely considered one of the worst zombies maps ever. Um, I don't exactly know what the issue is with it, I've heard that it's got very little flow to it as a map. It already looks extremely silly from the cutscene, but you know, zombies are always silly. Okay, so we're playing as a Scottish fella, I don't actually know what their characters are called. Hello, cunt. Why would they be using a spade, all four of them, as a melee weapon out of interest? So we've got a car 98k. Fuck it. Wish it wasn't scoped, but... We've got to make do with what we've got, I guess. Yeah, that is fucking daft as shit, but whatever. This uh, first room is not the most interesting, I will say. But at least we have a couple of uh, weapons to get started. We can open the apartments that way. There's usually two doors you can open. That zombie seems to be uh, glitching out a bit there, trying to moonwalk, and we can go into a destroyed building that way. I think the apartments are likely to be the first way we go. This is already a destroyed enough building. Let's test out this double barrel shotgun. I do kind of want to get out of this uh, first room because it's not the most engaging. Is there anything to grab while we're in here? It definitely doesn't look like it, but. Okay, so we need 750 points to move on. Something tells me we're not seeing the best thing in Berlin. Is it David Tennant that plays this uh, fella? I don't think it is, but he's like the only Scottish person I know. Well, this shotgun's got a bit of kick to it at least. I've told uh, the PS5 to prioritise zombies for Cold War, so that'll be the first thing that'll download. Keep talking, come. 
Okay, I think we'll open the apartments first. Oh, I thought it smelled bad in Middleburg. Let's get topside. Let's get armor, fuck it. We don't need a Type 100 yet. Or an SVT, I don't really like that anyway. Who left the fucking baby in there? Oh, do you reckon it's still in there? I'm getting real diarized uh, feeling about this building. That leads to the main street, we'll go out there in a minute. Uh, if we survive this anyway. What other options do we have for players to go there? That's the question. So far there is uh, no power restrictions on this map. Not much of anything really. Destroyed building. Well, we'll open it up and have a look. Oh god, this is bland. And then that opens up the main street as well. And we're in Berlin. This building kind of looks like the one out of Gurukrovi. But in general, this reminds me of the newest uh, Cold War map, Marl of Totem, which is also set in Berlin, so it's not surprising really. Could probably be doing with an automatic weapon right about now. We'll get one soon. We're in the main street. Sure up your crap twat. So another one of these pods dropped here. And we can go to the museum. I don't quite know why we were dropping down out of a pod. I will say that this map really isn't all that engaging. But I've not seen all of it yet, maybe it'll get better. What's that? PPSH, we'll grab that in a minute. Perfect for a weekend tour with the family! This uh, Scottish fella is absolutely bananas. Lovely. Whoa. Okay, this is getting a bit cramped. This is one we could be doing with, uh, again, an automatic weapon. I think we've got enough now. Don't show Indiana Jones all these. They'll want to make another shit film about a skull. Oh dear. Okay, let's have that PPSH now. Well, it's not as rapid firing as it is in Cold War. That leads to the plaza, we'll go out there next. Hello, what's up here? A combat shotgun. Why not? These are all weapons we haven't seen before. And another door to the plaza. Fifteen hundred. Okay. So this gun's got a bit of a kick to it. Yeah, this uh, map really doesn't have a lot in the way of atmosphere or anything, to be honest. I mean, I get that they're trying to take a step back from the absolute madness of uh, 
Black Ops 3 zombies, but this isn't really that good, I have to say. But it's not a tryout zombies map, so I'll give them some credit. They're doing the best they can, I guess. I wish those pests would fuck off, though. I mean... What is this map, even? Oh, this just leads back out here. So what was the point in even coming out here? In even going through that, I mean. Oh no, we haven't been here, sorry. I'm not just saying this because uh, a lot of people say it. This map is dreadful. Like, I could die on it right now and not even be bothered. The church to go into here. See if God can help this map. Cheeky con. Have a grenade. I don't want to know what happened to you. Fuck it, we'll grab that so I can get the um, weapon from in here. Has a nice weight to it. Okay, so is there actually any point whatsoever to the church? I don't think there really is. Every second wasted, another ally goes down. Don't worry about Lennon, mad. This looks like a radio frequency. God, why is it repeating the same voice clips over and over again as well? Could they not even be bothered to think any of This uh, map is pretty fucking dire, I'll be honest. There's another door there we can go through, I'll show that off. Unless I die now because I am not playing this map again. I feel like if you're gonna have an LMG as well, give it like a bigger fucking clip. Fucking 20 bullets in an LMG is not enough. I can hear something over here. Okay, this is the cabaret. What's up here? I mean, look at this. This is truly well, even in the middle of a war zone, you still need some entertainment. Can I borrow like, a quid? Pathetically bad design. I think uh, we're gonna get to round ten and then probably make a last stand because yeah, this map's not great. I can see why people don't like it. I don't necessarily think it's the worst map of all time, but it's definitely not very good. Let's go for a quick run back through the uh, area, see off the destroyed building, the apartments, which lead back down to the area we're starting, the ruin at the bottom where you go in through that drop pod. Oh no. Go for the flame! Oh. 
I'm being very quiet here, folks, but uh, what should I don't like them up? I really don't want to die yet. I want to at least make it to round 10. And there we go, mission accomplished, so now we can go and find somewhere to make a stand. Uh, we'll do a quick lap of the map, though. So I came out here. I went through the museum up here. But this also, it's like you've got all these different locations, a museum, a church, stuff like that. What is the real point to them? I'm sure for the Easter egg there's a point, but it just feels like so much wasted space. And as usual, I am got a fucking clue how to pack a bunch on on this game. Not that I'm bothered, really. I don't want to prolong this experience any longer than I have to. We're not even going to grab perks or anything. So yes, then I went through here into the church. Let's uh, pray before God. God help Sledgehammer develop a good zombie map one day. Every second wasted, another ally goes down. Don't want to make Lennon mad. That's probably got something to do with these track. But I don't think I'll ever find out because I have no intention of ever attempting this map sea strike ever again. Oh, not ever again, rather, ever in general. I have no intention of playing this map ever again. Also, that is probably the worst accuracy in history. Where's up there go? Well, I think we'll go and make a stand in the church if we can make it back there without dying. I believe after this there's only one proper map and then we have the tortured path to go through as well. Which I think at least switches it up a bit even if it's supposed to be awful. Yeah, look at that in. What the fuck? Oh, it's the big guy. As usual, the goal is just to kill the big guy. Take our uh, revenge for what happened in the final Reich. He's probably going to kill me now. How many fucking bullets does this come on attack? There we go. Back in the church. Although this is probably not the best place to uh, try and make a stand. Why is the map gone like monochrome type? Not quite monochrome, but... I don't know if that's deliberate or not, but it feels like the colouring's gone off the map. Also, what's the boss zombie going to be like on this map? On uh, the darkest shore we have that thing with the tentacles on its back. The feelers. We have the burner on Final Reich. I'm not seeing any sign of a boss on me yet. Go 
be honest, I might not end up seeing one either. Because uh, I'm out of armor. I'm getting my ass handed to me. And that's the end of uh, wave 12. Oh well, I. Do you want to rush me then? Somebody needs yes, you do. Oh, you fucking bastard. Oh dear. Every second wasted, another ally goes down. Don't want to make Lenin mad. Sergeant, look out. Somebody needs a leg. Those big guys are a problem. I just want to see what the boss for this uh, map is. I mean, surely the boss zombie can't be as bad as the uh, map itself is. I think it's unlikely I'm going to see the boss on me at this point anyway. But. These fucking big guns can take a beating. I just walk straight into a explosive barrel zombie. Well, still no sign of a boss. Seems to be trying to charge though, does he? Oh, there we go. You prick. How is he shrugging off this many bullets on fucking insta kill? Well, he's gonna kill me now, isn't he? No, he's dead. What's the boss gonna be in this map? Oh god. That's predicted, I don't think I'm gonna find out. I mean, now it's got down to the point of actually just surviving against zombies, it's the same as any other zombies map, but uh, the map itself is dreadful. I really wouldn't want to come to doing an easter egg on this map, that's for sure. Two heads, one body! What do you mean, two heads, one body? Do the burner guys have two heads, the explosive guys? Maybe they do. Go get some PPSH, am I? I should make a difference. Oh no, we've enraged a charger. Somebody needs a drink! 
I was gonna say if it homes in on me now. I know you're supposed to aim for the spine at the back, but to be honest, I don't care enough. Charging, look out! I was gonna say if that homed in on me there I'd have been pissed off. Well, we're coming up on, yeah, round 15. How many times do I want to reuse the same fucking voice clips? Also, coming up on round 16, no fucking boss. I'm assuming you have to do something for these threads to trigger it like you did the burner on the final right. I think on that you've had to... Was it get the Tesla gun or get the first Tesla part or something? It's only a short range rate. Looks like the red armies are only hope, but we'll need the right frequency. I don't even know what you're supposed to do with that. I'm not gonna pretend to either. Every second wasted, another ally goes down. Come on then, give me a boss zombie. What is that? Oh, it's just a uh, regular. This uh, gameplay is going on a lot longer than I wanted it to, really. This is not a fun map at all. Nothing about this map that's actually interesting. Okay, so we're now going into round 17. Uh, if it gets much longer, I might uh, just deliberately die, to be honest, because uh, I've shown what I can of this map. I don't enjoy it at all. Oh, shit. I mean, I think that charge is probably about to kill me anyway, but... No, it's not. What is that? Oh, we saw something like this in uh, the Final Reich, I think. Just throw a few grenades. Well, I think... What the fuck? I think I've shown everything I can of this uh, map, folks, so I'm now going to let myself get swarmed. Really not a good map, and I really can't be bothered to continue with it much longer. So, yeah, I don't know what I'm doing with it. Not well designed. I'll see you next time.